Aloha, everybody. Arnelio again with a whole new routine for you to learn. This is a classic. I believe it's by Al Goshman, and it's called Coin Through the Table. In this, I am going to take this coin and smash it through this solid table. Now, normally, I'd use a salt shaker to smash it through, but we don't need salt in this house. So I've got this bubbles. Works the same way. All you gotta do is hit it square. It's gonna smash. You know what though? I'm a little worried that it might break. I'm gonna get bubbles and weird stuff all over me. So I better cover it. I think I'll cover it with this paper towel. Now I don't have to worry about it. And I'm just going to smash it right through here. Here we go. One, two, three. And it's got, what? Oh, it's still there? Well, one more try. One, two. Well, the coin's still there. But the bubbles are now under the table. You want to know how to do this, I'm sure. So let me show you. Now, if you don't have these supplies, you could substitute them. Any coin will do. Doesn't have to be a silver dollar. Any small cylindrical object, usually a salt shaker, because you're doing this at the dinner table, right? That works the best. For cover, I'm using paper towels, but you could grab a dinner napkin tin foil, whatever. The idea is you're going to form the shape of this cylindrical object. And when least expect it, you're going to drop it on your lamp. That's what I just did. I went like this when I moved it over to look at it. I just dropped it on my lap, just like that. It's called lapping. The, the, that's also called lapping, but it's not what we're doing. Okay, here we go. I am now going to smash this coin through the table using this. I go one, two, three. It didn't work. Bummer. This is where I release the bubbles. Come back again, and the coin's still here, but now the bubbles are under the table. Okay, everyone, try this at home, but don't perform it for anyone till you really got it down, okay? Thanks, and I'll see you next time.